An uncontrolled pandemic is a frightening prospect for humanity. Worldwide suffering and death, like the swine flu pandemic of 1918, that killed 50 to 100 million people, but with the swiftness of modern travel. Current vaccine production methods are too slow to arrest a pandemic outbreak. A typical influenza outbreak goes from start to finish in a matter of one to two months, while a vaccine for it could require three months or more. Vaccines are critical in the fight against pandemics via injection of disabled viruses or protein molecules into unexposed people in the hope that their immune systems can establish a defense. Vaccine injection, however, requires expensive and specialized handling, refrigeration and staff training that many places in the world cannot afford. Worse, current vaccines often induce inflammation, causing pain, requiring monitoring by healthcare workers and resulting in people's unwillingness to seek vaccination. We have sought to re-engineer vaccine administration with our Respire nebulizer for plasmid DNA vaccine delivery. A DNA-based vaccine can be produced in as little as two weeks, a critically important improvement in the face of a pandemic. The plasmid DNA vaccine has snippets of the virus genetic blueprint within its coiled and durable structure. If exposed to large forces, like in a traditional nebulizer, the DNA can be damaged and so nebulized vaccination has not been practical. Our Respire handheld nebulizer device forms inhalable mists of the plasmid DNA without such damage. The lung is ideal for DNA vaccination. It has a large surface area and is a direct route to the cardiovascular system. When inhaling the vaccine, sterile handling, refrigeration and trained healthcare workers are no longer required. But inhalation vaccination traditionally forms only a weak immune system response. Surprisingly, the Respire nebulizer gives a very strong immune system response in sheep that inhale the DNA vaccine from a ventilator. The droplets containing the vaccine are inhaled and deposited on the surfaces of the lung. Once the DNA of the vaccine is introduced into a person's cells, those cells produce antigen proteins. The immune system is trained to attack the disease by producing antibodies against these antigen proteins. There is no inflammation when using DNA vaccines. And of course, there are no needles for injection, making it much easier for a person to tolerate. Inhaled immunization using Respire is especially suitable for lung-related afflictions, such as influenza, and potentially for treatment of systemic diseases like malaria with entirely new DNA vaccines.